Welcome to DOS Geek. So what we are looking at here is a tool called Scrappy SCRCPY Scrapcopy from Genie Mobile. But this is an awesome application despite not having a very good name. This allows you to screen mirror your device to your machine, which is just absolutely awesome. If you ever need to do tutorials with your phones or show people games or show them specific settings to get things working on devices, being able to mirror your phone onto your desktop so you can see the actual mobile device is just an awesome thing. So I'm gonna show you how to do that real quick. The first thing you're gonna to need to do is enable developer mode. And to do that, you're gonna find your build number on your particular device, mine's under software information. You're gonna click it a bunch of times. That's gonna open up an option on Android for developer options. You're gonna turn on USB debugging mode here. And once that is on, you are pretty much set up with your phone, except when you plug it in, you're just gonna to need to click okay, that you're gonna allow this computer to go ahead and um, open up, allow USB debugging mode between the computer and the phone. And once that's set up, all we have to do is install P. So S-C-R-C-P-Y, in this case, I'm using the AUR to install it in Arch. And then you just type that same command by itself, although there are other flags and you can see we are now mirroring my S8 device onto my desktop. And so I'm scrolling through some Mastodon here, just a very cool, easy to use application that you can get running immediately and you could do it wired or wirelessly. Now we're gonna put up some Shattered Pixel Dungeon, which I know Zeb from the Destination Linux podcast with me. He loves pixelated games, so I just had to show this one. This is a game I found on F-Droid, which is a great alternative to the Google Play Store if you're on an Android device. So this is Shattered Pixel Dungeon out there and you can see it goes in landscape mode. When we turn the phone in landscape mode, we can also put the game in completely full screen mode if we want, there are flags that will allow you to do that, or you can just, like I did, maximize the window there. And so if you want to stream a game to Twitch or YouTube gaming or wants to show instructions or just mirror your device for some other reason out there, just so you have a bigger screen to display it on while you're doing something on your phone, this is a really cool tool to utilize. I will have the link to the tool in the comments below so that you can install it on your platform of choice. Hopefully it's Linux because that's the best choice here. Do not judge my gaming here and the fact that I die even in pixelated games. Don't you do it in the comments. I hope you enjoy the video. Until next time, get out there and fill your brains. The video.